European Commission's Joint Research Center is working on introducing the principles of the three R's replacement, reduction, and refinement of animal use for scientific purposes in primary and secondary education. The lead teachers of the 3Rs project, coordinated by European SchoolNet, have contributed to the co-creation of educational activities implemented throughout the project. Some of them have shared their own experience and impressions about teaching the 3Rs materials and other project activities. I found my students being very attracted by the 3Rs topics because they connect science and real world issues. Even though implementation of the 3RS resources can be challenging, I found it to be a rewarding experience as well. This topic allows us to bridge the real world with the classroom, to combine curiosity and discovery with curriculum-based contents. To those teachers who would like to try implementing the 3RS topics in their classroom, I would suggest engaging students by connecting the topic with their everyday life. Try to be open and to involve other teachers for help while addressing this topic in the classroom, mainly because of its cross-curricular nature. Additionally, I would recommend using the 3D virtual lab because it's motivating for students. When I initially introduced the project, I was worried because it is different from what we usually teach, but the students' response and engagement surprised me. Participating in the project and events such as Career Chat allows my students to learn about different career paths they can pursue in the three R's. The chats created a wonderful learning community. It was also very nice that the speaker was a young woman uh, involved in a very cool project about uh, organs on a chip. This was very inspiring, especially for the girls in my class, and laid the ground for a discussion about gender equality in STEM. I think the three R's topics are very relevant to the subject I teach. For example, biotechnology, which is a subject in biology courses uh, related uh, alternative methods to animal experiment. I taught 16 uh, lessons as part of 3Rs project and my favorite topics uh, was alternative methods to animal experimentation. My students never heard of alternative methods and they were very interested in this subject. I would recommend the teachers uh, who want to teach 3 hours uh, topics in their uh, classrooms to join MOOC by European SchoolNet Academy and take advantage uh, of the learning scenarios and um, additional materials provided there. I will definitely continue uh, implement 3 hours topics in my classrooms after the project ends. I have been teaching the 3 hours topics in my classroom since the beginning of the 3 hours project, which make it three years for now. This topic has become a part of our standard curriculum at the school, as the 3 hours lessons are an important contribution to raising students' awareness about animal use in science. For those teachers who not yet write the three R's materials in their class, I suggest taking their time for research of existing material. There is a lot to be found online that can be adjusted, combined and integrated to new cool learning stuff. I would also recommend teachers to search through the European SchoolNet's wide range of learning scenarios on the three R's and choose an approach that suits you best and that you think your students will learn and enjoy most from.